channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you my favorites. Like these are the go-to items that I have been reaching for nonstop ever since I got them. Some of the items are a little older, some of them are a little newer, and I have probably about 10 to 12 items. Like these are the things I have been using constantly. I am just in love with them. I don't think I've done a favorites video in quite some time, so I'm really excited to share these items with you. So if you guys are new to my channel, make sure to hit that little subscribe button, and if you want to see what my current favorites are, then keep watching. Okay guys, before I begin, I am so excited to be partnering with Ana Luisa once again on this video. You guys know I have partnered with Ana Luisa multiple times in the past. I'm a little obsessed with some of their layered necklaces, but not only do they have layered necklaces, they have a ton of beautiful pieces that not only are they beautiful, but they're also good for the environment as well. Another thing I like in the boxes that they come in, it's 100% recyclable shipping materials, and then they also have re reusable pouches that you can use. You can use them as travel cases for your jewelry. So what could be better? So I have three items I wanna share with you today. Of course, I have another layered necklace, this right here, here is the summer necklace. It comes with two pieces right here. It has a beautiful heart. So this is actually another item that I think would be good for Valentine's Day. I like this so much that I actually got my friend Pam one as well. But once again, you can wear this just the two pieces or you can layer it with other necklaces. This one in particular, again, called the summer necklace. It's gold plated and it also has a lobster clasp. And the nice thing about this is you can kind of put it on depending on the length you want. And I'll show you what I mean. Like see in the back there, how I have this little piece coming out. You can put it on any loop that you want. I kind of like to layer it this way where the plain one is shorter and then the heart is kind of a little bit longer, but it's up to you how you want to wear it. But I was so excited to get this one. Another necklace that I received that I'm super, super excited about about is called the Miche necklace, but this is another necklace that is stunning. You can wear it alone or you can layer it with some of the other necklaces. So you could even layer it with this piece as well if you wanted. But once again, it is gold plated and it has this beautiful gemstone. This necklace actually in particular was a collab with Michelle Choi. So I thought this was absolutely beautiful. I love the color of the gemstone. So again, love this piece, wear it alone or you can definitely layer it. And again, it comes with this little pouch right here for travel or storage, which is really cute. And then the last piece I wanted to share are the earrings that I'm wearing. These are the mini Abbey earrings. They are 14 karat gold plated. And once again, they're very, very dainty. But the thing I like about these earrings is they look nice from the front or the back. And I like to wear these with layered necklaces. I'm the type that if I like to wear statement earrings, I don't really wear a necklace or my necklace will be a little more subtle, but if I wear a necklace like this where it's more of a layered necklace, I like to wear smaller earrings so that it doesn't take away from the necklace. And these are so pretty and they're perfect for that. And I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out of these, especially in the fall, because again, you know how much I love my layered necklaces. These are really great for everyday wear as well, so you're definitely gonna get your money's worth for sure. So I encourage you to check out the website. They have a ton of other beautiful pieces. They have bracelets, they have rings, they have earrings, they have more necklaces. If you're not into the layered look, they have pieces starting from $39, so I encourage you to check out the website. And Anna Luisa was kind enough to offer me a coupon code for my subscribers. Keep in mind, it's not an affiliate code, so I'm not gonna make money off of it, but if you use this code, you will save an additional 10%. What could be better? So thanks again to Anna Luisa for partnering with me again on this video and let's get right into the favorites. Okay, so for this video, I didn't want to just pick out like random favorites. I wanted to pick out the things that I've like really, really, really been loving. So everything I mentioned today are tried and true things that I can't live without 
ever since I started using them. So the first item I want to mention are a pair of sunglasses. And if you guys have been following me on Instagram, you guys probably know the sunglasses that I'm referring to. And these are the Fendi sunglasses. I shared these on my Instagram stories because these sunglasses were actually part of the Nordstrom anniversary sale, but I was too late to the game. I wasn't able to get them in time, but then I found them for 70% off. I shared them on my stories. I think they have since sold out for 70% off, but I will try to see if I can find them on another website. But these are by Fendi. I have the black. You can see they kind of have a little bit of a square cat eye, I would say. And then on the side of the glasses, it just has the Fendi logo. These are really, really chic. They have uh, gold at the top. Really, really pretty, but I like them so much that I got them in the brown as well. Now these, they are the same style as the black as you can see, but they have the Fendi logo all throughout. I absolutely love these. And these, like if you're someone who has like a monogram bag from Louis Vuitton, it matches well with that. Or if you have a Fendi bag or something like that. But this is like a great way to get designer sunglasses for a fraction of the cost. Make sure to follow me on Instagram because I will be sure to share these with you if they go back on sale, but they're great sunglasses. I have been wearing them nonstop ever since I got them. So not only were they affordable price, but I really, really loved them too. Okay, so those were the sunglasses I've been loving. Now I'm gonna share with you a bag I've been loving. And if you guys have been following me at all, you know the bag I'm gonna talk about. This Odeon PM, I can't say enough good things about this and ever since I did my unboxing if you haven't checked that video out make sure to do so I have been in love with this bag I have been very casual lately this has been my grab-and-go bag I don't have to worry about it because it doesn't have vaquetta so if I go out in inclement weather if it's raining I don't have to worry about getting water spots I have gone on and on about this if you want a detailed video of this I did do a po I did break it down doing the positives negatives mod shots check that video out if you're interested in it but just really quickly I love how it has this little luggage tag. I love that it has a pocket for my phone. Um, it can fit quite a bit. I have mentioned that the one flaw with this is the interior is black, so it can be a little difficult to see your things. I would just suggest either getting a really colorful organizer for it or get pops of color for your SLGs. But it's a great bag, it has a very thick, sturdy, adjustable strap. It's comfortable to wear, it kind of fits and molds into your body. But I have just been loving this, you guys. Absolutely loving this ever since I got it can't say enough good things. Okay, now I wanna talk about a key holder. So you guys know I have a little bit of an obsession with SLGs, but I really try to switch them out so that I feel like I'm actually using them because I don't want them to just sit. And I have an item that I've actually had for quite some time, but I have been using it lately. Not only have I gotten a ton of compliments on it, but it is just, it's so good, you guys. It is my M Prant key pouch from Louis Vuitton. So I have been using this. I know I've mentioned to you before that like I use this when I go to the gym. It has my key fob. It has my other keys, my gym membership. And then behind here is where I keep uh, my ID, a major credit card, maybe a little bit of folded up cash. And I remember I was in Ulta the other day and the lady was like, oh my gosh, I love your key pouch. Where'd you get it? And I told her, she was like, that is such a good idea. And it really is a great grab and go item. If like, let's say you want to just run to the store really quick and you don't feel like taking a purse. I do that sometimes. This is all I need because it has my ID, my credit card, a little bit of cash, and it has my keys. So this has been my go-to lately. Absolutely love it. Okay, so I mentioned a key holder. Now I have to mention a compact wallet. You guys, do I have, you know what I'm gonna say. And it is my Rosalie right here. Ugh, I gush and I gush and I gush about this thing. And then I gush some more. I just love it so much. It's so cute and compact. This is from the Wild at Heart collection. So I love the black. I love the pink combination. I just think it looks really, really pretty. I kind of like the animal print. But the reason this is so good, and I'll just kind of briefly tell you again why it's so good, is that it has a little spot right here for some coins. It has a place for your cards. And then there is a little compartment back here for you to fold up cash. Um, you can either fold it once and put it in the back or you can fold it up multiple times. And this is a good item if you're someone that carries a lot of cards and you just wanna be able to 
reach in, you know, pick a card, not have to worry about them in like card slots. It's been really, really good. It has held up so nice ever since I purchased it. I've been using it every day. It's really good. So if you're someone who's looking for a small compact wallet and you carry a lot of cards, look into this. It's also the Rosalie wallet in general is priced well for Louis Vuitton. It's $400, which don't get me wrong, is still expensive. But if you think about Louis Vuitton and how it costly some of their SOGs are, I feel like for as much as you use that, for all the benefits, all the functionality of it, it's a good price. Okay, now let's talk about a perfume I've been loving. Everyone likes to smell nice, right? Now, I have been on a perfume kick lately. I've purchased quite a few perfumes, but I want to mention the most recent one that I have really, really fallen in love with. And if you saw my recent shopping vlog or shop with me video, I'm sure you know which one I'm going to mention, but it is the Baccarat Rouge 540 out of perfume. I never say that right. But you guys know that I had wanted to try this. I mentioned it in my stories and I got so many mixed reviews. Some people said it's the best scent they've ever smelled. Other people were like, eh, I don't really like it. So I went in there, I tried this one and then I also tried the red bottle as well. Both of them smelled really good. The only reason I got this size is because this was 195 whereas the other one was like 310. So I opted for this one. I didn't want to get the full size because I wanted to make sure I liked it. But I have, um, it comes with three, but I have two here because the other one is in my purse. They're like little travel sizes. But this just smells so sweet and like addictive and very sexy and sultry. It doesn't smell like anything I've ever smelled before. It is extremely potent. So what I would recommend to you guys is go into Neiman Marcus, Saks Fifth Avenue, test it out, and then walk around the store to just see how you like it because it definitely works different with different people depending on their pheromones, but I love it. I can see why it's so popular. It is pricey, but I think it's worth your investment and it has been, I've been wearing it every day since I've gotten it. Granted, it hasn't been very long, but I've worn it every day since I've gotten it. And I think that's saying a lot because I have a pretty good size perfume collection and usually I try to change it up, but I can't seem to wear anything else but this right now. Okay, let's talk blush. I used to do so many makeup videos on my channel and I haven't done one in a while so I, maybe I will do another get ready with me chit chat. I used to do those all the time. But I want to talk about a blush I have been loving and it actually is kind of a surprise. So I'm not going to lie. When I heard about this Christian Louboutin palette, I was like, I'm a little suckered by the packaging. I like the fact that it had like the studs on it. So you have to buy this separate from the refill. But I thought, oh, this is going to be something I just have and don't really use. But I really do use it. So you buy this holder, this compact. You can get it in black or red. I kind of wish I would have gotten in black because you know you have the black shoes with the red bottoms. Instead, I just got all red. But anyway, that's beside the point. So I got this refill right here. It comes with two blushes and a highlighter. So this peachy shade right here, I have it on today. It is so incredibly beautiful. It really is. And I've gotten a lot of compliments saying, oh, what makeup are you wearing or what blush are you wearing? And this is the one that I pretty much wear every day. I'm sorry, this is the one that I wear pretty much every day. Occasionally I'll wear this one, but I really, really, really love this peach shade. And you can see um, I have really, really gotten a lot of use out of it. So I love that. And then on top of that, I like this right here. So let me do a couple swatches so you guys can see. Okay, so hopefully you can see that on my hand there. Here's the highlighter, and then here are the two blushes. It's a really, really good palette. Again, it's pricey, but this is refillable, so you can hold on to this case. I just have been loving this. So the blush and the highlighter are two favorites, but I have another highlighter that I want to mention because I haven't just been using this. Okay, another highlighter that I want to mention is, this is by Chanel, and I cannot read it, but it's like a balm. It comes in a tube like this. And what I've been doing is after I apply my foundation, I have been taking my finger like so, and I have just been tapping the balm on the top of my cheekbones. And then I will take a damp beauty sponge and I will kind of dab it in my skin. And you can see it just gives you a glowy look. It just kind of melts into your skin and it gives you that like wet look. So let me do like a little swatch so you guys can see what it looks like. Again, it's like a balm, like a highlighting 
balm. Can you see that right there? So it kind of just makes your face look really glossy. So I've been using this and then I will apply some of that Christian Louboutin highlighter on top of it and it just gives you that nice glowy skin. If you guys have been a subscriber of mine for a long time, you know that I was obsessed. I still am, but I used to really be obsessed with highlighters. Highlighters are my go-to. If there was a new highlighter that came out, I would jump on it and I would get it, but I'm trying to be a little better now when it comes to makeup because I ended up throwing a bunch of makeup away and I just felt so uh, wasteful because I couldn't use it all. So now I try to kind of just stick with products that I know I'm going to use. But that combination of the balm and then the Christian Louboutin highlighter, I've really, really been loving. Okay, the next favorite I want to mention is something that I'm actually surprised how much I've worn this but I've been wearing it like every day and if you checked out my shopping vlog where I went to King of Prussia I picked up this bracelet right here it is a wrap bracelet from Hermes and you guys I don't know what it is it's just kind of like edgy I've been wearing this every day as you can see today I have like a nice blouse on so you can wear this with like black pants but I also wear this when I'm very casual as well. And I just love it. It just wraps around. You can see it has like little studs there. It has like a little ring. I just really like it. And I find that I've actually worn this one a lot more than my other Hermes bracelet, which was the Click Clack H bracelet. I just love this. So this has been another favorite of mine. I've been reaching for it every day, wearing it all the time. I just really, really love it. It's just black leather and it has the silver here with the two little studs. Really, really cute and edgy. Okay, the next item I wanna mention is a pair of joggers. I am all about comfort and I love joggers. I probably have every color joggers. I have green. I have blue. I have black. Multiple pairs of black. I have red. I have navy blue. And I want to mention these joggers. These were on sale. They are the Zella joggers. I will put a picture of me wearing them up on the screen. These are really, really lightweight. So they're good for the transition from like summer to fall where it might be a little bit chilly. Like let's say you're going to a soccer game at night. It's a little chilly, a little, little too chilly for shorts, but you want to wear long pants, but you don't want to wear sweatpants. This is perfect. And they still look a little stylish too. I paired these recently with my Burberry bag. It matched really well. And this is a great color for fall, but I loved these so much. They were on sale. They're Zella that I got a pair of black. Now I do also like the Under Armour joggers as well, but I wanted to mention the Zella because these were on sale and these are the ones I've been liking so much and they're just so soft, but they're like really stretchy as well. So I am all about comfy and casual, but yet still attempt to look semi cute, I guess. So I love these joggers. I had to mention them. Okay, let's talk lipstick. So I have not been wearing like the type of lipstick that I used to wear when I would go into the office where I would have the lip liner and the lipstick and then maybe the gloss. I haven't really been doing all that. I'll either just have a clear gloss or I'll have this, which I usually wear every day. This was another one of those items that I was pleasantly surprised by, and it is the Hermes in the color Rose Tan. First, can we talk about this beautiful pink packaging? So the reason I like this, you can see it says Hermes, I don't know if it'll show up, is this is kind of very sheer. Like you can see it just gives you a little bit of a wash of color. It feels like a little waxy, but it's something I've been using every day just to give my lips a little something extra. So it kind of enhances them a little bit. I have, this is what I have on my lips today. I don't have a liner. I don't have anything else. I just have this, but I love this color. I'm a huge fan of mauve tones and it is so pretty. So not only have I been using it every day, but the packaging is so beautiful. And again, I have a couple other Hermes lipsticks, which I like, but those are more lipsticks. So they're a little more opaque. This is a little more sheer. So it gives you just that wash color and I love it a little bit of a splurge but if you're looking for an item to wear every day consider this guys we are coming down to the last item and the last item is a drink we are going into fall today is actually Wednesday evening tomorrow is the 22nd of September which means do you know what that means 
first day of fall, my favorite season. I've already decorated. I'm so excited. I just love all the fall things. I can't kick my Starbucks habit. You guys know that, you know, I usually have the tall iced vanilla latte with one stevia. Well, the past couple of weeks, well, I would say the beginning of September, whenever Starbucks started their fall drinks, I don't know the exact day, I started getting a tall iced vanilla latte with one stevia, and then I had them add one pump of pumpkin sauce. Mm. So good. I started using a straw because you guys know, I think I mentioned on my stories that I had some cavities, so I'm trying to be a little bit better about using a straw. But this is so good. This is basically fall in a drink for me. So I recommend that you guys try it. Tall, iced, vanilla latte, one stevia, one pump of pumpkin sauce. Now, I did try the sugar-free vanilla, but I don't really like the sugar-free vanilla. I just like the regular. Mm. Give me a second. So good. So I had to add this to my list of favorites this year, this month. I just love it. You definitely have to try it. Okay guys, there you have it. Those are my favorites. These are all the things that I have been loving. I would love to know your thoughts below on things that you have been loving. And make sure to check out Anna Luisa. As I stated before, they have some of the most beautiful jewelry, especially their layered necklaces. The layered necklaces are definitely my favorite. They were kind enough to offer me that coupon code. I'll put all the details down below. Make sure to check out their website in case there's anything else that you're interested in. Have a wonderful day, you guys. If you are new to my channel, make sure to hit that little subscribe button. And I'd love to have you following my Instagram as well. I will also make sure to link everything I mentioned in today's video down below in the event you guys are interested in anything. Thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in my next video.